Contestant, ready? I'm ready. Hellcat horse. Can he make the shot? Oh my Ooh. God! No. This one is the cyclone. My head went back seven times. Got me spinning. <laughs> Drop 40 Productions presents Hellcat Horse. You ready for a spin? Let's see what you got. Come take a shot in Hellcat Horse. Our competitors will have three chances at each station to make a shot. It will be timed, and they'll be shooting with a different kind of ball than what I've got in my hand. Can you score out of the passenger window of a Hellcat with a ball made for children? Before we officially get started, I'm gonna introduce you to the driver of this monster Hellcat, owner of Drive Stick Shift LLC, an organization in Brooklyn, New York, dedicated to teaching individuals how to drive stick, keeping manual transmission alive. I introduce you to Anton. But you just call me Drive Stick Shift. Honestly, I just call him Stick Shift. That's literally a name I have for him. What are you uh, expecting today out of Hellcat Horse? I don't even have expectations. Just being able to drive Kitten around. I'm just gonna hope not to do too many burnouts. So we're gonna stop delaying, we're gonna get him in the car, and we're gonna get our first contestant up. Oh, it's always such a pleasure. How are you feeling? Have you ever done anything like this before? No, this is the first, and it's just too much to look forward to. Kind of put it into words, but it ain't all quite coming together. Things either just show it. Get behind the wheel, or pump the pedals, clutch and row. Our first contestant, Instagram name? 717 and 718. Um, you excited? I am excited, very excited, yes. Let's get you in. Right. Remember, it's three shots at each zone. We've got zone number one, which is just basically what a layup would look like. Then you're gonna loop around to zone number two. That's a little bit of a further shot. And then that last shot, try not to get dizzy, call it the cyclone. After the cyclone, you get it back into the final shot. You think you can make it happen? I think it happen. All right. Now remember, if the competitor score the same number of baskets, the fastest time will win. All right. Contestant ready? Driver ready? Hellcat horse! Coming around the bend. That first bend is a really weird angle for the driver. But he is an absolute pro. Gets right to the shot. We got three shots here. We got three shots here. Remember, it is time. It is time. That's a miss. Miss number one. And that's miss number two. Going for the last one. Miss number three, and then we're going to the next spot. He'll get the balls back the moment he gets to that next spot. All right, he's at the spot. He's gonna take the first shot, get the other two balls back. Can he make the shot? Oh my God, the hardest shot to make he'll make. And then he misses with the next one. And finally, all right, listen, I'm gonna read back. Now this is the shot we're looking for. Here's the Cyclone. It takes a lot to not lose the tires when making that move. Such a good move. And that's another miss. And the, the host is going to get the ball out. All right, that's two. And that's two. We've got two shots. Talk to me, Bart. How you feeling? I'm a little dizzy. I ain't going to hold you. Okay. <laughs> There's something about a Hellcat going in a circle. How do you think he did? Oh, I think he did great. <laughs> no, honestly. Some swoosh, a little bit of a reject on one, but what do we get, two or three? We got we got two, so the score is two. And remember, if anyone scores two, we're going with time. All right, 717 and 718. Give them a hand of applause. Well, let's meet up with our next contestant. Coming out of Brooklyn, I think. Do you see the lineup? There's something beautiful in my mind about this much muscle. There's just something beautiful about it. 717 and 718. All right, contestant number two. Tell me your name. Tell me where they could find you. My name is Nick. I'm from Westbury, and my Instagram is Nick underscore two underscore quick one. And let's see what I can get done today. All right, how you feeling? Now you saw 717 and 718 go, and uh, he made two shots. Two shots in pretty good time. How you feel? I'm confident, you know, because, you know, I'm a better shooter. We've got a little bit of friendly competition, or maybe not so friendly, we're not sure. All right, let's get you in the car. Good luck, Hellcat Horse. Remember, it's timed. 
that may come, become a factor at some point. Just throwing it out there. It's maybe become a factor. Contestant ready? Driver ready? Hellcat horse! Coming around the bend. That first bend is a really weird angle for the driver. Coming around the loop. Remember, this is a really good layup. Getting out the way of the car. Slamming on that brake. Shot number one, it's a miss. Shot number two is a miss. Shot number three. Oh, that's a good shot, that's a good shot. Now we're coming around Pike's Peak. Getting right up to that line, all right? He's at the next one. Oh, that's a miss, number one. Miss, number two. Miss number three. This one is the cyclone. Remember, it takes a lot of skill to be able to make this move and not lose the tires. Lines up perfectly at the cone. Shot one. He needs one more. He needs one more to make it. That's a miss. Last shot. Can he tie it? It's a tie. It's a tie. How does it feel to tie 717 and 718? Whew, this was, it was hard, man. I, What's the hardest part about it? Never been in SRT. Mm, so that loop-de-loop -loop is a little... Yeah, it got me spinning. <laughs> All right, how you feel he did? I think he did good. He kept together well. If you feel nervous, I couldn't tell. Let's get him back to the starting gate. Who's up next? Tell me who you are. Tell me where we can find you. My name is Nick. You can find me on Instagram at Felon50RS. Felon50RS. Right. How you feeling? You just saw two people go? Yeah, I'm feeling a little bit more confident. Feeling more confident? Why, why, why more confident? I don't know. I got to see what it's like, so I think I could do a little bit. So. All right. All right, let's get him in the car, and we'll get ready for the next contestant of Hellcat Horse. Make it a champion. Let's see what's up. Contestant ready. Ready? Yeah, ready. Driver ready! Hellcat horse! All right, they're coming around that bend. Remember, that first move is very steep. Coming around, oh, and the G-forces in the vehicle are powerful. That's two. And three, that's a miss, that's a miss. All right, getting around to the next one. Coming around Pike's Peak. I call it Pike's Peak because he's gotta loop around very quickly on a mountainous move. All right, that's miss number one. Two. That's a shot, that's a good shot. All right, now the Cyclone. Can he withstand the power and the might of the G-forces of the vehicle through the Cyclone? It's a very good stop. The G-forces in the car, you're not, you're not aware of it unless you are familiar with the power Ooh, of an SRT. Man. Last shot, last shot. Oh my gosh! All right, two for two. Clutch, how does it feel to be clutch enough? I thought I was gonna do better, man. All right, so we've got two. Do we think you scored fast enough to be able to top Nick? I'm not sure. I think I did, but I'm not sure. How about you? I'm optimistic. Came in with the confidence of a champion. Yeah. Didn't flinch. Two is good. That's still the top. How'd he do? All right. We'll see you. All right. Anti, I'll meet you at the start and you get on out of here. All right. We're going to check our numbers and we'll be back in just a bit. All right. So. We got a good friend of mine coming up. Tell them who you are, where they can find you. My name is Chris, Chris James. You can find me at 007 Chris James on Instagram. They know. How do you feel about getting into an SRT powered supercharged vehicle? I'm definitely excited. I've never been in one, so I can't wait to see how it feels. Perfect. So let's get him in here. Hellcat horse. Contestant ready. Driver ready. Hellcat Horse! Now what you gotta remember is this move is actually pretty steep and he's missing that by just a just a slight bit. Getting in there, that's one miss. All right, gotta grab those balls quick, come on. It is still timed, two miss. And the driver's already getting ready. He wants to give him that advantage. Good shot, good shot. Now, coming around Pike's Peak, which is basically coming off of the curl. Getting right into the next portion of the shot. This one is 
This one's the one that everyone's oh, been making, interestingly man. enough. Everyone's been making this shot. All right, and he's got the arm strength to get it up yeah. there. Remember, part about Hellcat Horse. All right, now we're going into the Cyclone. The weird part about Hellcat Horse is that it literally is like... I'm sorry, I I'm, I'm just in awe of the driving skill. All right, can he make... All right, that's one miss. So miss, we may have to go to the clock on this one. We may have to go to the clock on this one. Oh! That was that was a good run. It was a good run. It my game, but I love it anyways. All right, so talk to me. How'd you feel? I feel crazy right now, man. And the thing is, he's not sliding the vehicle. It takes more skill to be able to keep traction, especially when, you know, you got 700 or something. So how do you feel at this point? You had a chance to drive in a Hellcat. I would be in a Hellcat. Let me tell you something. Hellcat is no joke. Hellcat, no joke. My head went back seven times, and this car only drove four. So, I, so my how do you think he did, though? I think he did good. Thank Kept you, it composed, got the first shot, started strong, yes. and then I just took over and started whipping him around. So that's a little on me, I'll be honest. I'm still a little heads, bro. All right. All. So what we're going to do is we're going to say goodbye to our driver. Thank you so much for getting us through the first few contestants of Hellcat Horse. At a certain point, we're going to pick up a new driver. I'll meet you back at the starting point. So, four contestants. We've got a bit of a tie, if you will. Let's see what the timing does. Let's see if the timing sets us up to uh, crown a winner. All right, so I do, I do want to say thank you to our driver. Again, at Drive Stick Shift. He is the owner of Drive Stick Shift LLC. Meet up with him if you're trying to learn how to push that on three pedals. Gentlemen, good luck. You'll need it. And lady. Oh, you out of here? Yeah. Yeah, we got driver. All right, bro. Actually, technically we have two, but she's on camera, so I won't make her. Let me consult with the judges. Give us a moment. Judges. Nick. Nick. And Ash coming through the first round with a combined score of six, two each. You've made it through to the next round. And the course has changed just slightly. So now you're gonna be taking the car. The car is gonna come around the side. You're shooting from the passenger side again. The car will come back around a complete U-turn. You're getting out of the car and you're gonna shoot three more. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. So it evens it out just a touch for those of us that think we got a jump shot. Who's gonna win the first edition of Hellcat Horse. Based on the time, the person with the slowest time will be up first. That person is Ash. Oh, yeah. Come on, Ash. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready, I'm ready. Let's jump in, let's get it. Hellcat Horse. Contestant ready. Driver ready. Hellcat Horse. First shot, bad. Next shot, just off. Take her, look at the wrist, look at the wrist. All right. Jump out the car, jump out, jump out, jump out, jump out. Jump out, you can get the pass from him. Need just one, just need one. It's three, it's three, it's three, get the ball, get the ball! Woo! There you go. See, I had a right. to go to feel good. Yeah, boy. How you feeling? I'm good. Now, that was a real jump shot, though. That was a real jump shot. Come on over, talk to me. How you feeling? Do you think if they score one, that you have the fast enough time to be able to say you won. I'll be honest, I don't think so. The next time up, Nick. Come on in. Driver ready. Hellcat horse.
Definitely talk to me what happened. Very disappointed, you know, missed my shots. I was confident, but. All right, all right. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna get him back to the other side, grab our last contestant, and continue this final edition, or the final uh, shots, in the first edition of Pokemon Boys. Seeing your competitors go up, what did you learn from those competitors? <laughs> But the ball's going to the right, so I'm going to aim a little bit to the left, hoping that it goes to the right. Oh, word, that's what you're trying to do? He's got a whole strategy. He's got yeah. a whole strategy. I love it. I love it. So, will he take the goal? Hellcat horse. Driver ready. Hellcat horse. With the best time in not only the qualifying round, but the final round, <laughs> Nick. Hot off the presses, your very own Hellcat Challenger. This is, this is Kitten with Stripes. So, you get to have that one. That is your trophy. The next time we do this, there may be a belt. Whoever wins gets a Hellcat, all right? <laughs> How's it feel? <laughs> it feels get, great to compete, you know. Everybody was a good sport about everything. So, I am the chef boy. This is fellow 50 RS, AKA Nick. Hellcat horse. You know. To all of us here, with some power, and with the car community behind us and in our hearts, Hellcat horse. I am the chef boy. You just got the recipe. <laughs> Oh, man, I don't know about you. I have fun. I'm sorry. I have fun. Yo, all right. Hellcat horse.